Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve if you're running into problems with the Microsoft Store and now you're getting prompted that the Microsoft Store needs to be online. It looks like you're not. So if you're experiencing this problem, this should hopefully be able to resolve the issue. Again, we are assuming that everything else works with regards to your network and you're able to get on the certain websites, but the issue is specifically with Windows Update. So with that out of the way, we're going to go ahead and jump right into it. And we're going to go left click on the start button and type in troubleshoot into the start menu. One of the best managers should come back with troubleshoot settings. You want to left click on troubleshoot settings from that list. You want to scroll down the right side near the bottom where it says Windows Store Apps. Troubleshoot problems that may prevent Windows Store Apps from working properly. Left click on that and then left click on run the troubleshooter. This might take a moment to run here, so just be patient. So it might give you some suggestions here. I would suggest following along with whatever it suggests. So again, just go along with whatever it prompts you here. There's a couple more things we're going to go through as well. So just select on next. Again, it will hopefully be able to resolve some problems if it's finding anything. So you can see it did find the service registration is missing or corrupt and it was able to fix it. However, we will have to log in with Microsoft account. Hopefully that should have been able to resolve your problem. So if you just close out of here, attempt to restart your computer and then see if that's resolved the problem. If that has not worked for you guys, go ahead and open up the star menu again. Type in wsreset.exe. So again, wsreset, all one word, .exe. You don't actually have to add the .exe on the end. If you don't want to, it's fine. Best match should come back with wsreset. You want to right click on it and then left click on run as administrator. This is going to reset the Windows Store here, so just give it a moment to run. and just be patient. And there you go, it's reopened the Windows Store. So hopefully at that point it would have been able to resolve the problem. If not, there's still a couple more methods we can go ahead and try. First of which, well they're actually both going to involve the command prompt here. So just type in command prompt into the start menu search. Right click on it and then left click on run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, left click on yes. I'm going to have two commands in the description of my video. I want you to copy the first one that starts with DISM. Copy out of my description, so just control C or copy it over, right click and then copy. And then go up to the command prompt window here, right click on the top, left click on edit, and then left click on paste to paste it in. Hit it on your keyboard. This will take a couple minutes to run here more than likely, so just want to be patient with that. And even if there's a blinking cursor, you still just want to wait. It's still running here, so just be patient. It might take a minute or two to actually start up.
Okay, so once that command is done, we're going to go run another command here. And this would be just the SFC CNL command. So again, copy out of my description, right click on the top bar of the command prompt, edit, and then paste. Hit enter. It will take some time to run the system scan. I'm not going to show scan in its entirety here. You will have to restart your computer once it's done regardless, and then hopefully that should have been able to resolve your problem. So as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.